um, I think we'll be top four, top five, but we're not going to quite sell our soul like we did indoors. Indoors, we really ask people to do a lot, um, doubling and tripling, which is not a normal thing for Syracuse, but we knew we could win. Um, we have to think more long term in terms of nationals, and this meet's going to be in 90 degree weather, and it's just not conducive to uh, asking guys to run three races, we, and we need those kind of points to try to win it. But we'll be a player in the meet. We'll have some champions. Um, we'll do really well, but we'll position ourselves better for nationals where we'd like to have a top 10 finish. Uh, you know, we just keep up the same level of performance that we had in fall and uh, in indoor. I mean, we kind of like to make our mark on the ATC. We like to show them what we're made of, and we plan on doing that again this weekend be quite as fit as we were like indoors for conference because the very two weeks later is nationals so this way with a month you have to be more judicious about your training and plus we have to go back to Florida for regional so it's it's another week down there in 90 degree weather which is just not what we're ready for at this point so um, we have to kind of temper our efforts right now and be really smart about what we do so we can last another five weeks um, you know always want to be Top three basically at ACC, first team all ACC. Um, but with these races, you know, they're not really, they usually don't go out too fast. They're mostly tactical. Uh, so really, it's just, I want to be as many guys. Yeah, I think Philo, Germano will run really well for us. Uh, Hubbard and Palomar should run great in the 1500. Um, I expect a few more guys, maybe Mickey Burke or uh, somebody young to step up in the five or 10. And um, then I know there's some good young hurdlers. Uh, you know, uh, Floyd, we think he'll run really well, and hopefully Lee will run well in the 100. Uh, we'll do okay. It'll be kind of like indoors, just not quite as bold. Uh, you know, just excited. I mean, this is just uh, really this weekend is just another, I mean, it just gets us even more ready for the end of the season. Um, so we're just going to use it, get a little more experience, get ready to race these guys again in a few weeks, and then hopefully in a month out in Oregon. I really hope to see um, Margo and Shay run well in the 10. Uh, Margo's the defending champ. She seems to be coming around just at the right time. Shay always runs well at the ACC meet. So we expect those people both to score in the 10. And um, then we have some young people that are getting their first taste of the ACC. I don't really expect them to score, but we're hoping you know, maybe something comes of it. Tia will run well in the hurdles. Shayna will run well in the 100. Uh, we have a really good four by four, pretty good four by one. So. Uh, we'll do okay. Uh, we'll have a good meet.